For the CAD Geek, I'm Donnie Gladfelter, and in this video, I'm going to share with you how to use Adobe Illustrator to convert PDFs back into AutoCAD DWG files. In order to accomplish this, I'm going to begin by opening up a PDF. So here I have a PDF that was created from AutoCAD in this case. And the great thing is, since AutoCAD is a vector-based program, it creates vector-based PDFs. And the great thing about that is the PDF support inside of Illustrator allows that vector data to come across. In fact, if I uh, click on one of these lines, you'll notice that all of these lines have come across as vector entities. So Auto, or sorry, Illustrator has recognized that for me. So the great thing is you don't really need to learn Illustrator in order to do this. In fact, all I need to do is come up here to the file menu inside of Illustrator and then choose export. Now, Illustrator lets me export to all different types of file formats. Among them happens to be the AutoCAD DWG file format. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose export. It's gonna give me some basic options right here. For instance, I might choose that one inch is going to be equal to 12 units over inside of, or actually one unit over inside of AutoCAD. And I'll let all the other options uh, choose or, or remain as they are right here. And I'll choose OK. And just like that, I have created a DWG file. Now, if I switch over here to AutoCAD, I come up here to open. Let's open up the DWG file that I just created. It's going to tell me since it wasn't created from an Autodesk application that it wasn't well, created from an Autodesk application. Just continue opening the DWG file, and here you're going to have a AutoCAD document with all of the vectors in place that you could begin working on. Now, the unfortunate part is everything does come over in a single layer, but aside from that, you do at least have the vector-based information that you can begin working with inside of AutoCAD. So there you have it for the CAD Geek. I'm Donnie Gladfelter. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope to see you soon.